Hey guys, my name is Dylan and this channel is geared towards filmmaking and editing. So if you are new here, check out the channel after this and consider subscribing. So today I'm gonna to teach you how to upload custom LUTs into your GH5 so you can preview it while you are shooting in vlog. Because most LUTs are .cube format, we will need to convert it to .vlt so that your GH5 can read it. So what you're gonna do is go to this website which is cameramanben.github.io. I will link this in the description below so you guys can easily click it. Basically this website is going to allow you to convert that .cube file to a .vlt. So what we're going to do is press new LUT here, choose file, we're going to pick the LUT you want. Once that pops up you are going to make sure everything is selected for Panasonic. So you want to go to camera first, make sure Panasonic is selected. They do not have the GH5 in here, but uh, that does not matter. Make sure GH4 is selected. It will still work. You're going to go run through all of these and make sure Panasonic V-Log, V-Gamut, and everything is set up. Um, it has S-Log in here. For some reason, that pops up regardless. Whoops, not Fujifilm. Make sure all of those are pressed. You're going to pop down here, make sure input gamma and input gamma are Panasonic as well. You want the analysis dimensions to be 33 by 33 by 33, and you're going to go 100% to 109. Then we are going to press uh, analyze, and to show us what that has done, we will press preview. So um, if I go back... Do this and then I'll press reanalyze. You'll see that it shows you the preview ahead of time, which is quite nice. You can change the file name so when you're in your GH5, it has a different name. So we'll just call this uh, GH5 LUT. The next thing you will do is make sure it is pressed on camera. I think generally it comes in grading LUT. So make sure this is pressed on camera. And like we, like I said, you're going to change it to a .vlt file. After that, you'll press generate LUT. Once it is downloaded, you will drag that file to your Lumix SD card, which should be plugged in. And then once that is downloaded and transferred, eject the card, put it in your camera. Once you flip on your camera, head into your settings and under the first tab, you'll head to vlog view assist. Make sure you have vlog selected as your picture profile here. Once you press it, your uploaded LUT should be in there and you'll press read LUT file, add the selected file, press LUT monitor display and you are done. Now you'll get a sense of how your vlog image will look with that LUT on it while you are shooting. If you're interested in seeing some of my films that I have shot in vlog, I will post those on the end screen right now. Do me a solid and press the thumbs up button if this video helped you out and I hope you guys have a great rest of your week.